Welcome to a video from thedigitallifestyle.com. Time for another Windows 10 build video, and this one is 14905 for Windows 10 Insiders on the Fast Ring. This is a Redstone 2 release, although Microsoft do like to call it RS pre release, so they don't actually specifically call it out as Redstone 2. So, um, also available on mobile as well, I've done a separate video of that, you can check that out. So, what's changed on this? Well, not a huge amount really with this one. Um, I did notice this big notification up here with an action center showing you um, how to get to nav action center and what, what it can do. Apart from that, there are a couple of other things like um, they've fixed issues with blank white space, they fixed issue in the rain. So one of my favorite fixes here is in uh, Edge. So you're on a web page like this, you want to open a new web page or just go into the address bar, you do control O and the focus is set on the address bar. So even if you're on uh, a page like that where it's open and you do control O, the focus goes back up to there. So you can do control O and control X or control V to paste it back in or whatever you need to do. So I think that's a nice subtle change but well uh, well worth doing. They say uh, they fixed issues with sketchpad and screen sketch crashing as they changed the ink colour twice in a row when the ruler was visible. I haven't come across that because I haven't done that combination but uh, it's good to know that. Um, what are the fixes in this build? Or the known issues I should say. There's more as they're creeping in as we're on to the, you know, the early stage of the development platform. Uh, the kernel debugging's been removed, fair enough. Acrobat Adobe Reader still crashes when you try and launch it. That was in the previous build. Um, you can use the Microsoft built-in tools or Edge or whatever, so it's not really a problem. Main one, I think, is Cortana's text-to-speech. Uh, it's not working this, so Cortana won't read out things to you. That's the same on the mobile build as well, but they are working to, to fix that. Uh, when you click on the power button, uh, you don't get the option to do restart or anything else. So you can see it just does that. So um, the way you've got to do it is uh, right click and then you've got the, the options on there. Uh, some apps like Yahoo Mail, Trivia Crack, Google and Skype Translator Preview will crash with this build and the settings app may crash um, in certain screens due to a DLL uh, missing. Now this doesn't affect here just because I'm using the pro version but I have seen other people uh, mention this to me on the previous build so if you go into say um, account screen or whatever it will just crash because we're missing DLL. Um, that isn't the case on, on my machine, but that's because I'm in the pro version. I think it's the home version that's doing it. Although I did have a home version machine test, and I did test on that worked okay as well. As well. So it's just affected different people in different ways. So that's it really. There's not a huge amount of changes. Um, good to see these Redstone builds coming out, or Redstone 2, 14905. You can have a look on our YouTube channel at the mobile version and all the PC versions going right back to the very first preview for PC and mobile. So thanks for watching this one. You can find me on Twitter at Dixon on the digitallifestyle.com.